What is this? Shanks! The fraud of the century is on the scene, bro. I'm surprised they started with Shanks, though. Like, what the fuck? Look at, look at, look at this fraud acting like he cares about any of these people. It's like, hey, Shanks, you could have been here at any point in time. Ah. <laughs> it's like Whitebeard. Oh. Damn, he sensed them from the air. God, Shanks' observation hockey must be fucking crazy. He's, oh. Do I smell a bitch, nigga? Who's over there? And here I am to fuck everything up. Fucking Akainu fanboy. <laughs> they feel a like hater on the wind. Is that hate in there? Oh. They ready. Hey, hey already. Can't always have somebody there to protect you, right? You gotta protect yourselves. It's really nice of Green Bull to take this desolate area and then make it have flowers and vegetation and shit. Not that bad. He's still an asshole. Rise oh quick. Oh, okay. Oh no, you ain't touching him with that. This is an admiral. You fat bitch. Oh, take her out. <laughs> nah, <laughs> he's chilling right now. Knocked him back. Jack. Surrounded. Nope. Nope. Uh. Get out of here. Nope. Caught the blade. Decked him in the face. Now he's gonna give him the wood. This fucking animation on him. Make him like a damn demon. And Joe had to come in there and save his ass. Okay. Okay. Fucking Hashirama over here. <laughs> he said this is a natural order, bro. Sacrifice of a few is a central piece of the mini. God damn, he's huge. No pause. Extra long. Look at him. God, Yamato. Back to Shanks crew just chilling. <laughs> like, what? Fucking monster, the greatest character on their crew. 
<laughs> and we're actually gonna see the real Ben, ba ben Beckman, not that shit in the One Piece live action. <laughs> that motherfucker, I'm like, bro, Ben looked like he had a little bit too much donuts in that fucking live action. <laughs> Oh, you're just a bad dad. <laughs> I still ain't got enough money for that fucking child support. I gotta pay them back taxes, nigga. God damn. So I'm really not ready to see my son. You mean the son you abandoned and left with his dying mom? I'm <laughs> like, you mean that son? Yeah, bro. <laughs> if I were you too, I'd stay out getting that milk. The hell? Oh, this is when they, uh... Got the Goma Goma no me. When who's who got fucked over. <laughs> old school Yasop over there. So you don't understand who's who. This is Shanks having to jump in for the red con. Like, that's all it is. Man, they're taking us back to the beginning. They're gonna have him have the whole my have, uh, how have you grown moment. So this is, this is the hat that a real nigga gave me, but you know, I've only been a fraud with it the entire time. That's my buggy, never mind. <laughs> Acting all tough after he ate your arm, let's be honest. ルフィに会う気はない。ルフィの子分だっていうバルト。未来の海賊王ルフィ先輩。その一味のステッカー食べ。この島の。ファキンバルト。バルトロメオ、ファキンスティーブ。ヘイ、ちょっとステッカーで
Momo actually gonna come here and fight? Oh, right off the bat? Oh, I was about to say, I was like, oh shit, Momo! You threw some flame crowds, but that was all you could do. <laughs> Snake ran at him. The only way he knows how to fight. Momo is hemmed up already. God. God, they make Green Bull look menacing. Damn, Akainu making a proclamation? One Piece. He's going after the One Piece. Frauds will always fraud. Never notice that Shanks didn't go after the One Piece when Kaido and Big Mom were around and Whitebeard were around and shit. No, he's just been sitting around hiding the entire time, just waiting for these old niggas to die or something. So you know what? Fuck this nigga. He got his ass whooped by a fucking Sea King at the end of the day. They wanted to look tough like... You better get out of here. <laughs> Either way, we have Green Bull, of course, against some of Akazaya 9, plus Yamato to some extent, but Momo doesn't want Yamato to fight at this point in time. But Green Bull, on his bullshit, he's like, you know what? Sometimes you just gotta make niggas slaves. Like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Sometimes people just gotta take an L at the end of the day just to help prop up the many other people in this world. So... We're seeing his true colors, him just being a dumbass at the <laughs> him being an asshole with it. Also seeing Shanks go in there, taking the devil fruit from, of course, uh, who's who and nobody else. And they just had who's who there. That's all we really know. And just some random ass people and leading, of course, with Luffy eating it and stuff and becoming Nika at the end of the day with Gear Fifth and whatnot. Um... <laughs> I know some of you niggas are mad that I call this nigga Shanks a fraud, but to me, he is he's one of the biggest frauds in this fucking series. <laughs> and I'm not even talking about it in a traditional sense. But, um... Sabo supposedly killed... He supposedly killed King Cobra. We all doubt that, right? Supposedly kills King Cobra at the end of the day. But this has helped propping up the revolution even more because, you know... People hate those that are in power because those people who are in power are, you know, subjugating all the people below them, kind of going into what Green Bull was talking about and stuff. So, because King Cobra gets X'd out, a lot more people are jumping up at the chance of revolution and feeling inspired by Sabo to the point in which he is basically more famous or uh, more of a central figure than even Dragon himself, like rivaling that. That's that's crazy at the end of the day to have that situation pop up from it especially because cobra wasn't a bad guy at all it was a you know fake situation that happened with crocodile and everything that was going on in his own people so it makes you really think like what how his own people were going to react because everybody in alabasta seems to love this nigga so it's going to be really uh, hard on them but worldwide news wise it's it's actually a good thing for these revolutions to actually start propping up sabo and a few good men went against of course two admirals like they said before in the previous episodes and stuff and got off with kuma at the end of the day also shitted on celestial dragon mark <laughs> so we eating good we eating good sabo fanboys eating good revolutionary squad we eating good at the end of the day shanks of course is here 
Uh, of course, with the fraud Yasop at the end of the day, this guy is just a horrible father. You know, I, I just don't want to see my son. I'm not ready to see him yet. Yeah, because you have so much back child support, you don't want to see him. <laughs> All right. Even Dragon checked in on his little nigga one time and just let him go. He's like, you know what? Hey, <laughs> let my son go. So, you know, we have that at that point in time. But Shanks supposedly wants to go after the One Piece. Why has he been waiting all this time? Who the fuck knows? But he did it. But we all know who my goat is. It's Buggy. All right. So fuck Shanks all day, every day. It's Buggy time. You know what I'm saying? New Emperor. He's going to be the true Pirate King at the end of this series. And I don't want to hear nothing else. <laughs> So, either way, that is pretty much it. I really enjoyed the episode and stuff. Didn't think that they were going to start off straight with just Shanks at the end of the day. Um, even with him talking about these fraud things about how, you know, how Momo and Hiori was doing and shit. Like, nigga, never checked up. Uh, so, um, that's cool and whatnot to actually have that. But, great things for the next episode should be coming. I'll see you guys later. Have a good one. Peace.